All right, here we are, Origins 2016 coverage, and I'm here with Lee and Tommy and their wives in the back from Meeple Realty. Uh, they make custom wooden inserts uh, to help us as uh, game consumers store our games and make setup and uh, tear down really, really quick and easy, keep all of our pieces sorted. So we're here to talk about a little bit of their products. So why don't you guys uh, go ahead and give a little bit about uh, your company and what you guys are doing. Well, like, like you said, David, we are a company that makes wooden inserts. Um, we make it inserts so that not only does it ease the setup time, um, but we try to add a little spin with our inserts. We want to make it that it enhances the experience of the game. For example, we have, I can show you, if you want, I can show you some products sure. here. Sure, awesome. So right here, as you can see, we have Arkwright with partner with Capstone Games, who's a couple yep. aisles over. They're re-releasing uh, re kind of mm -hmm. Arkwright here. Arkwright's a heavy simulation game. And in Arkwright, what we try to do is we, might, we try to make setup a little bit easier. During the game, you'll need to take these wooden workers and place them here in the little in little uh, little squares here. Right. But who wants to place all these little workers on these little squares? So what we've okay. done is we've kind of created this tray where you just line yes. up the workers and you go ahead and lift it up and you're Boom. ready to go, ready to go play. There you go. And That's then when awesome. you're done, you kind of just put the workers all back here. And then what you do is um, you take a little container here. Set it's on the board, okay. so it's not additional. Okay. So, and you just kind of put it back, and you store it, and you're you're good to go. Awesome. Now, while you're waiting for the next player to take their turn, since it is a heavy game, we have a little spinning Jenny here. You can play with as there a first player marker. Right awesome. There. That's cool, and it does spin. It That's does awesome. spin. It does spin. Originally, this is the the first player marker, but we figured like hey, of, the purple cube is kind of boring. We want. That right. kind of fun stuff. If you're gonna bling out your game, bling out your game. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> all right, now all you know, we also offer an Orleans Deluxe insert here. Okay, so deluxe. Okay. A so. bendable wood option, so you can easily scoop out your pieces there. Nice. We offer a wide variety of other products. We have 26 inserts right now in our product line. If you want to pan around sure. here, we okay. Have an official Carson City insert designed by Mr. Tommy here. Okay, I'll Tom. I'll tell you a little bit about that. Okay. Insert. So basically, Carson City. Uh, if you actually own the Kickstarter. Version. It okay. actually comes with a lot of meeples and uh, for how long the game has been, it actually has multiple variants. Okay. I believe, don't quote me, but I believe there's like three or four variants along with the game. Mm -hmm. And then, so what we're trying to do here is like, we actually make sure each of the variants has their own um, container. So okay. like for example, you have a horse variant, you actually has a horse, it's actually a label horse. Okay. And then you have all of those like rodeo tokens, the wooden tokens, and I mean like the cardboard tokens and also the okay. wooden meeples. And then we also, it also come up with the setup tray. So okay. all of this tray, you need to basically, uh, obviously you need to learn the rules. Right. Our insert's not going to teach you how to play it. Right. But the, 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 the aim is to basically make it easier for setup. Right. So this whole tray, you basically pick out which character you want to play. If you have, um, you need to set the mountain and all the different stuff. This is literally after you, you're done with the setup, you set it back in the, in the board games. Okay. And then aside okay. from that, we also have this uh, resource tray during the gameplay. So you, you need to take houses, you need to take river, uh, the road and also you need to take guns and high in, uh, high income files. Okay. All of it is nicely separated so you can actually like, okay. um, doesn't need to be like, oh, which one, where can I get my house? It's like right there. Right. And the, another cool part is like we actually designed it so it's actually like boom. Opens so you can up. scoop it out. Oh, nice. Because some, um, sometimes it's actually kind of hard to take things yeah. out of the Especially space. when we get down towards the bottom, yeah, exactly. so that's good. And then we have the Western theme printing on there for the bank. For the banks, and then the banks the same way. You you can remove this and then scoop things out. Nice. So you get all those like metal yep. coins that just flow right out. There you go. And then aside from that, we also try to make it a, a cool name. Most of our product, if you notice, we actually try to relate to housing. Mm -hmm. So this particular one, we call it the Carson City Saloon. Okay. And if you look at it, when you arrange, this is a, for player trays, basically each color has their own trays. Okay. And then we also shape it looks like a saloon door. Okay. We actually put it together. Okay. And then we also take advantage of a bendable wood right there. Yes. So, so just like some nice little shapes there and things like that, so. Yep. Yeah, again, we try to make a little, you know, a little, 
uh, a little, the experience a little bit better with each, yeah. each one of our inserts. For this key flower insert, we have here the uh, the tray that holds all the tiles for key flower. Yep. This tray right here is kind of like a little boat that with a little kind of a you know a retractor in there that allows you to kind of store the uh, the, the tiles so nice. everybody can see them. That's cool. And there's a lot of people that love key flower, and Absolutely. the best way to have it is to have the farmers and the merchants. Absolutely. And everything all goes right in the box. Everything goes yep. in the box. Everything. And you don't need to break the house. Right. The Look houses that. sit like nice and tidy there. Everything sets up. The box sits flush. Everything you know is ready for you to, to use. Cool. If you want to look over here at a blood rage insert, again, we want to make sure we try to make the experience a little bit better. In our blood rage insert, we actually have all the factions in our little compartments here. And here's a cool little thing. Tommy got bored one night and wanted to play a magic trick on me. He goes, you know what, Lee? I can't get all these pieces to fit. So he said, you know what? I'm going to put all these pieces sideways like this. But when you're ready to play, you're going to go ahead and take that and bend that over like that and put the uh, locking mechanism right there. Cool. So essentially what's going to happen is this locks into place and you're ready to play and then all the pieces kind of arranged. Nice, so you right spread there. them out but then it closes up nice and compact. That's correct, that's yeah. correct. And so. each of the game come with two. This is the first one and then for the monster we also have for the god. Okay. And then we utilize every single space on this box. If you, if you notice like for fraction, since the soldier doesn't have spear, they're actually located on the um, four corners right here. Okay. You can come up and then you set it on your board and then it's ready to play. Okay. Aside from that, in order, and the other storage solution that we did is like it actually come in the drawers, you can pull it up and then there you go. You have nice. your mystic, you have your leader, you also have your uh, Kickstarter exclusive markers for your games and nice. including the ship. Cool. And then also with the big, uh, the big Monster, figure, yep. big monsters and figures. Looks like they're all uh, have a spot carved out in the box where they sit, so they're not going to yep. be moving around the box either. Yep. And we actually designed it so it actually cut perfectly to the shape of the base, and it's actually snug fit in here. I believe also I saw that it has the name of the yep. which thing goes in there. So look, we've got the mountain giant is going to go there, so everything's going to fit in, and it has its own little name tag. So. You guys covered all the bases on that kind of stuff. Uh, we sure tried to have to do it that yeah. way. So. One of the other things I got to ask you to show off is if you can show the the huts from uh, from Bora Bora, another one of your oh. your creative things that you like to do. So. Um, I found out that Tommy's, uh, one of his favorite designers is Stefan Feld, so he has this bucket list to do inserts for all of his games, and, and you've seen in one of my previous videos, we showed off uh, Castles of Burgundy and Trajan, but Bora Bora, he decided to do something really, really cool for the storage solution for all the player pieces, and he made these huts, and so I think it's kind of cool to show those off, so, so here we go, Bora Bora, and anybody that owns the game knows there's a lot of pieces that come in the game, so... Want to unbox us and show us what we got ready? here? Yeah, we're ready. Let's see. So, you have all of this. And then we actually designed it so it actually fit perfectly with the map right there. Okay. And you can take it off. There you go. So, yes. we, we name our insert Huts of Bora Bora because each of the player has their own huts. Okay. And then the cool part is we like to make it like, hey, if it's a housing, you need it in a number. So we actually make a specific slot with our logo right there, and okay. then you can put in your number right there. And okay. then when when the turn order change, you can either uh, give somebody your marker, or you can directly change the HUD. Okay. And then the cool part is, this is all bendable. This is one whole piece of wood. It's right there. Mm -hmm. And then it actually pull it right here, and then snap it back in. Awesome. And when you want to take it out, you just pull it a little bit down, there you yep, go. And there's all the player pieces okay. inside, and again with Bora Bora, all the the uh, tiles and all the pieces fit right in the box. So definitely looks better than my copy, which is all bags and piled in yes. there. So, so uh, the cool part is we also have like the resource tray. So you pull this out, boom. So this is ready to ready for the game. And we also even included most uh, all of our product. We try to incorporate any of the expansion. Oh yes, yeah, so we have so the we orange have got the tiles, orange got tiles right there. And then the same way we did the Carson City, you can pick this one up and then scoop it up. When um, nice. that way, it's easier, a lot easier to pick it up. Nice, nice, nice. And you guys are, you guys are thinking of thinking of a, a lot of stuff to make it 
not only the insert good for storing the game and making setup and easier, but also being able to incorporate your pieces into the uh, into the gameplay. So you have your pieces yes. out on the table. So that's very cool. So and I also need to show this. If you see the Trajan, you have the mini version. Okay. okay. Boom. Oh yeah, so if you can see here with all the tiles, you can just grab right from the uh, the side, so it makes it easier. We don't even have to worry about anything to take off. We just lift yep. them up, they're so ready to go. So you have this board, you can even just like directly set it right there. There you go, awesome. So, all right, so it's just like a little bit of an overview of the stuff from Meeple Realty. These guys are, they're, they're the new kids on the block, but they've got some of the coolest ideas, and in my opinion, some of the, the, the best inserts that are out there. So uh, certainly want to uh, check these guys out. Uh, if, they, if anybody's interested, in getting your inserts, how can they do it? We are always available at meeplerealty.com. Okay. That's our website. We offer all our products there. If you have any questions, we'll be more than happy to answer them. You can reach us at meeplerealty at gmail.com. We're always very active on Facebook. We're always very active on Twitter. We're very responsive to any of your questions. So if you do have any questions, we'll respond very, very soon. Usually within a few hours, if not over 24 hours. So, yeah. Awesome, cool. So, again, this is uh, Tommy and Lee uh, from Meeple Realty, and here we are at Origins 2016, and uh, we'll see you guys all later. Bye-bye. See you around.